these students at a public high school separated by race. But what's happening in McCaskey East in Lancaster, Pennsylvania, it's far from black and white. It's a mentoring program conceived by an African-American teacher designed to close an achievement gap that was painfully clear in last year's standardized testing. 60% of the school's white students scored proficient or advanced in reading. Barely a third of its black students did. Even fewer black students aced math. So now, for a six-minute daily homeroom and a 20-minute session once a week, the junior class in McCaskey splits by race and sex and talks about the future. I specifically looked at research um, that focused on African Americans, what was best for their academic needs. Um, and one thing that some of the studies said from Maryland um, was mentoring. Mm -hmm. So we were already running with that idea. Mm -hmm. And they actually emphasized same gender mentoring. Wow. mentoring. Wow. So I proposed the idea to run an African-American male and female homeroom right. um, to the principals, and he was on board with it. If you want to like go to college and be one of those people to become successful in life. We invited school officials to join us, but they declined. Still, I want to talk about the challenges schools like McCaskey are facing and the ways they're, they're trying to meet them with Pedro Deguera. He's a sociologist and professor of education at NYU. Uh, thanks for joining us. You know, it sounds like something, uh, you know, a school who is on the ground taking a look at what their situation is and trying to, to fix it, uh, you know, really from from school by school. We hear that so often that in education, sometimes it's it's the school itself that, that can figure out what its own challenges are and try to fix it. But it's against the backdrop, Pedro, of very painful memories in this country of segregation. I mean, that's something that is a is a scar and a, a, a historical burden that we still grapple with. So is this school doing the right thing 